Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to uh, Pop Fiend's channel. Uh, second video I've made. Sorry about the camera. It is just my phone I am using for these. So bear with me a little bit on that. Uh, and only the second video I have made. So bear with me on that as well. Uh, if you guys got any tips, tricks, things like that, uh, go ahead and leave them down in the comments there and I will accept it any constructive criticism you can give me but uh last video that i had i got a 40 dollar mystery box from i believe it was insane toys i think it was uh and then i bought a i think it was a five six dollar mystery uh just one single mystery uh, pop for that and i ended up actually coming out about a dollar uh, or so ahead of what I paid according to uh, Stashpedia. Uh, but I ended up getting the Disney Witch, which was the mystery one that I paid. I think it was $6 for. Uh, I think it's listed for, what is it, $10 on Stashpedia. So, yeah, I made a little bit on that one. Not really uh, one that I collect, but hey, can't complain a whole lot. Uh, the other three I got were the f in the $40 box, and they were all either chases or exclusives to certain places. Favorite one I got, uh, Red Ranger from Hot Topic, uh, Metallic, pretty awesome. I have uh, some other Power Rangers ones, so I was very happy with this one. It is going for about $14 on Stashopedia. Uh, the other two, eh, not super excited about, was the Nightmare Cupcake only at Target, uh, which, you know, whatever. It's kind of a neat pop. It's, it's a little different from Nightmare at Freddy's. Still pretty cool looking, though. Uh, the other one I got was Young Ford, uh, 2017 convention, uh, summer convention exclusive. Watch the show, good show, only pop I have from Westworld. I think this one was, what did this one go for? About $13 on Stashpedia, I think Pop Price Guide has it at 20 I think, somewhere around in there. But depending on where you look, came out ahead on it, and I was very happy with the uh, Red Ranger there. But today I have, I know it's in this one, still going to open it on camera for you. Uh, this was ones that I got off of uh, Walmart.com. Tried it out, got them for a really good price on there, so can't beat it. Uh, this one here da -da -da -da, is a mystery box from uh, Toy Toy USA 2011. Uh, so this one could be awesome. Paid a hundred dollars for it, so. I hope I get something good in this one. We shall see. First, I will open the one I ordered from Walmart.com. Which some people may not be too excited about these. Uh, because the movie one of them is from... Didn't get the best reviews. Uh, didn't get packaged the greatest, but boxes are still in really good condition. Got uh, the Joker from Suicide Squad. I like the Joker. Personally, I didn't mind his version of it. Could have got a lot more screen time, but hey, a lot of people hated it. I collect some Joker pops, so this will go nicely in the collection. The other one I got is the Batman Arkham Knight Harley Quinn, which I love Harley, my fiance loves Harley, uh, we have like three or four other Harleys, so I got pretty good price on this one, so I had to pick it up from Walmart.com. Uh, all it was was some bubble wrap and the box, and the pops are actually, and boxes are in really good condition surprisingly because sometimes when you order off there it's iffy on uh if the boxes are going to be in good condition or not 
but these ones are pretty pretty decent okay now the one i am nervous for box number 45 out of 100 from toy usa this one let me see here what the top prize could be for this one i believe it is a glow in the dark vader if i can find it here let me look okay maybe i won't look it up on here because i have the wrong tablet See if I can find it real quick here for you. Okay. Does it have it on their Facebook? I've seen a lot of people open these Toy USA 2011 uh, mystery boxes. My brother actually had picked one up and he didn't come out too bad on the end it wasn't what, exactly what he wanted but he was pretty happy with a couple of pops that he did get from there and i actually believe he busted even on it if i remember him telling me that right uh okay which box was it here the one that i purchased was okay where'd it go I'm on their Facebook page right now. Ah, here we go. It's got a big sold out sign in front of it, but, and you cannot see that very well. Uh, it was the glow in the dark Vader. There was an Obi Quan Jinn. And uh, yeah, I can't wait anymore. I'm just gonna open it up and see what happens. I'm going to try not to look at it. Okay. I'm going to feel and see if there's any hard protectors. I got a hard protector. No. Don't think I got a pop stack. But they are. I got some packing peanuts. Ah, oh, yes! This is actually one of them that I wanted. That is fucking awesome. Got the Michelangelo Coast City Styles, one of 2,000. Uh, gray scale, it looks like, with uh, just the orange bandana and uh, all those little orange deals on him. That is awesome. Not sure what the price is on this one, but that's a good start. So let's go ahead and stick him over here. That is freaking sweet. Okay, let's see here. Not gonna look, not gonna look. They are in, not in pop protectors. They are just bubble wrap. So I think that was the going out of the box, which I am fine with. Ooh. I don't have a lot of Star Wars ones, but this one is actually pretty cool. Amazon exclusive first order Stormtrooper. Box is pretty good on that one as well. So that one, yeah, that's pretty cool. So, and the next one is another Star Wars. Grimorian Gamorian, I'm gonna murder that, so I'm not even gonna attempt it to, to pronounce that, but that is the other pop that I got. Gonna look it up real quick, see how good I came out on this, but that Michelangelo is awesome. So happy with that. So let's uh, take a look here on Stashopedia. We will look up the the guard here. See what we got. 
think he's just a common, I'm going to guess. Okay, where are you? I was going to say, there's no way it's that one. That's the blue labeled one. And there's the black labeled one. Why can't I find it? Well, that's weird. Okay, yes, he is just a common, but he may be vaulted. He's only $10, whatever. Well, we're going on to the next one. The Stormtrooper. I'm going to guess 20, 25, maybe. Oh, never mind. 11. So, $21 so far. But let's check out this Michelangelo. What do we got? What do we got? $59. Not as high as what I thought, but I will take it. It is still cool. So we got, what, $59, $69. did not quite make it to $100. But... That's what you get. Sometimes uh, you can either come out way above or slight loss on it, but I'll take it. That Michelangelo is one. I actually, if I were to get one and wasn't the Grail ones, they had that one and I believe they had the Raphael. So, pretty happy about that. Uh, anybody uh, know of any of the other ones of these that they have? Comment down below if you have one. Tell me about it be awesome to hear uh, but that is all I have for now don't believe I got any other boxes on order but I think I have some more pops coming in that I know what they are so I can make a short clip on short video on those guys if you uh, would like so comment down below give me a follow give me a subscribe if you like it give me some tips on what I could do better on this so uh, you guys have an awesome day